Hi guys, so today I'm going to do kind of like an autumn smoky eye look for you. Um, and I'm going to be using Max Cranberry eyeshadow for this. It's this really lovely sort of like burgundy, berry sort of toned colour, which I absolutely love using, especially around this time of year. Um, yeah, so I've already done my base makeup, so I've got Rimmel's Make Me Up foundation on. Um, a little bit of MAC Harmony, just to contour my cheeks. And um, NARS Orgasm Blusher. Now these are my like three sort of go-to base products at the moment, I really love those. So I'm going to start by taking a little bit of Clinique's gel liner, um, you can use any sort of like gel liner, this is just my favourite one, and um, instead of applying it as you would do a normal eyeliner, I'm just going to take it all over the lid. So I'm just using this flat brush from um, Urban Decay, and this is going to be kind of like a base for the eyeshadow. I find if you use like a real dark base um, and then put a lighter eyeshadow over the top, it just really intensifies the colour. Um, so I'm just going to start by patting this all over my lid. Not too much because you want it to be able to dry, but you know, enough so that you get a nice deep colour. Okay, I'm just going to blend that out just at the edges. Just make it a bit softer. And take that underneath the eye as well. Okay, and then I go on top with the cranberry. This is such a pretty colour. And just really like pack it on. And you just see how like by using that colour underneath, that deeper colour, it just really intensifies the shadow. And taking that underneath as well. Okay, then I'm just going to blend a little bit of MAC Harmony. This is just the contour colour I used. Just into the crease where that kind of comes into the eye. Where the colour finishes. I like putting a bit of like a warm toned, either like a shadow or just like a bronzer on top of a smoky eye just because I find it makes it look a little bit softer and it warms up the eye whereas using kind of like quite cool tone colours can just sort of almost like drag my eyes down a little bit. Okay then taking this just black from my sleek storm palette. I've had this for such a long time. There's actually a really similar colour to cranberry in this right next to the black so if you're on a bit of a budget and you can't quite stretch your MAC eyeshadow because they are you know ridiculously pricey then this colour I think would work really well as well. Okay, I'm just going to take a tiny bit of that black just on the outside corner. And a little bit underneath as well. And blend that. I'm just going to wing it out slightly just because it suits my eye shape better but you know, depending on if you suit more of a rounded shape or more of a winged shape you can just adjust it. My eyes just suit being sort of winged out a little bit. Okay then same on the other side. Black liner all over the lid. Underneath. Blend that out. Pack on the cranberry again. Okay, 
blend that through with your warm contour colour. And take the darker black on the outer corner. Okay, and then I'm going to take just a tiny little bit of the gel liner again, just to thicken the lashes out and define the eyes. And then I'm going to take um, this is an Urban Decay 24 hour eye pencil and just put that on my waterline any sort of black line will be fine if you kind of close your eyes and just press upwards it will do sort of like the top line as well so lining your whole eye ok clean up Probably wasn't the best idea to do my foundation before I actually did this because I've got loads of drop down. I'm going to pop a little bit more concealer just under the eye, just using Collection 2000 Lasting Perfection and just really make that quite bright under there. Okay, now mascara. I'm going to use Revlon's Grow Lashes. Really love this mascara at the moment for like really thick, thick lashes. So I'm going to put a lot of coats of that on. Got to have a thick lash with a smoky eye. Okay, so that's the eyes done, and I'm just going to finish it off with a little bit of uh, pinky gloss. This is Barry M. Um, lip gloss in coral. This formula is so lovely, they almost feel like lip balms. They barely have any like stickiness to them at all. Just to give it a little, tiny bit of colour. So there you go guys, that's my kind of like autumn smoky eye look and I hope you enjoyed that. Um, let me know if there's any other makeup tutorials you want to see, any requests, things like that. Um, and I'll see you soon.